First up tonight, a Topeka native is the inspiration behind a new Boulevard Brewing Company beer. But the story goes so much deeper than that. Only on KFNC News tonight, our Kelly Severi is live to explain why you'll see his face on the label of a new beer. Kelly. Yeah, Molly, that's right. Brady Smith was a graduate of Seaman High School right here. He's a Topeka native and he worked for Boulevard Brewing Company. Last month, though, he lost his battle with lymphoma. And now his employer, Boulevard, is honoring him in the best thing that they can do, of course, make a beer. It's this one right here. And guess what? Every profit from this beer goes to helping out a cause that he was so passionate about. From a label with his name on it. And Brian's sister put a plea out on Facebook, I would like to have one of his bottles. To a beer with his face on it. Boulevard Brewing Company has been remembering Topeka native Brady Smith since he lost his battle with cancer in December. We told you how Brady's family was asking people to look out for the holiday beers with his name on the neck of the bottle, something Boulevard does for every employee. Now they're taking it a step further to remember Brady's legacy, the best way they know how creating a beer just in his memory. When we walked into the, to the store at Boulevard and saw the display, it was a pretty, pretty humbling moment. It's called Never Give an Inch, Brady's mantra to get through cancer. I can't really emphasize how much this means to a lot of the people just at, even at the brewery. Brady's passion was to help underprivileged kids get involved in sports. That's why the money from beer sales will go to nonprofits that help kids who otherwise could not afford to play, which is one thing that gave Brady his confidence and charisma. As soon as I met him, probably within like five minutes, I, we instantly became friends. And that's been proven as the beers are selling quickly. And as of Tuesday afternoon, they're merely gone. I. I it's it's just an amazing feeling to know that our son touched so many people's lives. This Saturday would have been Brady's 31st birthday, and this Sunday would mark a year since he got diagnosed with the cancer that took his life. We hope in some way or another we make him proud by taking this money and, and making some of his goals come true. Advocating for opportunities for underprivileged kids was just one of the things that Brady wanted to do before his life was cut too short. Another one of those things was making sure that girls wrestling got the attention that it deserved. It was something he was also really passionate about. And now every single one of these $15 bottles will go towards causes like that and even more. 